A lot of teams playing in Chapel Hill. Adam, give us the rundown. If you're thinking about either coming into town a day early or staying a day late after the football game, you should do it because there's a ton of stuff to watch. Today, Friday, field hockey hosting Boston College at 4 o'clock. Volleyball hosting number six in the country, Louisville. That one's at 6 o'clock at Carmichael. It's going to be a challenge. And then at 7.30. Don't try to put limits on volleyball, Adam. Romani Thurman would tell you that that is loser thinking. It's going to be a challenge that they will accept. Yeah. And then at 7.30, men's soccer hosting Syracuse. I think that's the Syracuse men's soccer team. Yes. Football and football. Watch out for the tie. They are uh, defending national champs, right? Syracuse? I think that, I'm pretty sure they won it last year. Well, that's coming to an end now. Tar Heels are ranked 13 or 14 in the country. They're just methodically tying their way <laughs> to the top 10. Only unbeaten team in the yeah, SEC. Yeah, I mean, nobody can beat them. Knock on wood. Yes. Uh, men's and women's tennis have some ITA All-American stuff going on this weekend. Men's tennis is in Tulsa, Oklahoma. Mm. The women are in Cary. This is not like the ITA no. indoor national time. We're not there yet. It's not time yet. No, that's for the Tar Heel months. Invitational. Yeah, that's still a couple months away. Yeah. Uh, then on Sunday, all sorts of things. Volleyball's at home against Notre Dame at one o'clock. Field hockey's at home against Liberty at two o'clock. And then maybe make the little drive down the road to Duke because women's soccer, mm. big one. Duke's a top twenty-five team. That one's at four o'clock over in Durham. Women's soccer number one in the country. Men's golf currently number one in the country, although they're in their their fall season. Did we ever get the uh, field hockey one or two? I'm going to double check. I believe they're one. I'm going to double check while you vamp, Adam. Hard to imagine that I would not be correct, uh, given my depth of knowledge of the Olympic sports that I just displayed off the top of my head. Uh, we've been we've been given confirmation. Bob Ellis confirms in the window here that field hockey is uh, number one. How much is that Bob in the window? So, field hockey number one as well. That's a lot of number and one And men's teams. soccer, like top 15. Number one in ties. Yeah. I'm telling you, oh, I, the, the most impressive stat for me for men's soccer is that nobody scored more than one goal on them. Like, you're doing something. If you never lose... You can't be beaten, Jones. That's exactly right.